Okay, folks, what we have here today is a Howard Miller 611-034 called the Metcalf. Nice cherry wood case. It's rosettes up on the swan neck bench. Traditional style case. Case is in very, very nice condition. People who had this clock took very well care of it. Nice side glass panel so you can see the movement. Um, this case is not illuminated, but if you wished it to be, we could put a light in for you. As we can really with any of our grandfather clocks, but these ones that have the side panels uh, especially look well. With a light in them, you can see the movement. This adds another little feature. Open the door. Really nice uh, design on the on the white shells. Brass and all is in very nice condition. Another design down on the pendulum. Matches the white shells. Um, this clock also has the original owner's manual. And there's more paperwork inside that little folder that they put it in. Just gives you an idea of how these people took care of their their things where they actually took and put that owner's manual inside a plastic folder. It's the crank for the uh, winding. Go up to the dial. Again, all the brass is in excellent condition. Silver chapter ring. Does have a blue moon dial. Two moons. It is a triple chime. It'll play St. Michael, uh, Westminster, or Whittington. It also has a night shut off feature. So to turn itself off at night, if you got it near a bedroom, or, or you can shut the, the strike, the hour strike off, or you can shut off the quarter strikes individually or both. So you have those options on this clock, which was usually on a, you know, one of Howard Miller's higher end. Those are two um, options that didn't come with every clock. I'll let you hear the chimes. It's in the process of resetting itself here. Didn't do the quarters the first time because I had moved the hands prior to making the video. 
Um, modern grandfather clock will reset itself um, once you move the hands and that's what it was in the process of doing.